Well, you know what else has caught our attention? The fact that things have been shaken up at Good Up FM with a brand new lineup. Now, if you've tuned in ever since the 1st of April, you've noticed that things might have changed just a little bit. Driving to work, uh, the lineup has been completely changed with a brand new breakfast team and, of course, a brand new host. Might I add, the youngest breakfast show host of all time in South Africa. Of course, we've got Dan Corder, host yeah. for the most. We've got Sandra Rosenberg on news. We've got Jerry Saunders on traffic and then the one and only Dalen Oliver on sport. Make some noise, everybody. You guys, this is so exciting. What has the adjustment been like? Because this is a brand new breakfast show. Everybody's been used to something else and now all of a sudden you give them this awesomeness. I've just been waking up early. You guys maybe can speak better to the adjustment because you guys have been on breakfast for a long time. I think sometimes it's just like, um, you know, sometimes you have a really great song yeah. and it's an old school song, but sometimes you just remix it slightly mm, mm, and then mm. it becomes more pertinent to more people. Exactly. So that's what I'd like to think what our new breakfast show is. Yeah. It's a, a bunch of people who have just been remixed a bit. And so we're probably um, able to connect with a lot more people mm, yeah. because we're quite mm. a diverse crew. Like okay, a yeah. David Guetta, uh, Versace on the floor remix, you know? Okay. Just get oh, you on the chairs. <laughs> it's also cool. exactly like that Earth, Wind & Fire September mashed up with Migos is Bad and Bougie. Okay. I don't know if you've seen it. If you haven't seen that, you're such a YouTube DJ. right <laughs> you're now. Such a DJ. It's the best thing that's ever happened. Do you guys want to talk maybe about the other lineup changes and also what was the strategy behind this big move? So the other lineup change is that the glorious, I don't know if you've heard of her, she's very talented, mm. she's up and coming, Leanne Williams yeah, is hosting yeah, the yeah. So I'm good up FM. <laughs> no one makes any noise. Okay? <laughs> <laughs> oh and lunch with Leanne is literally the best lunch you're gonna have. It's oh, so much fun. It's so delicious. Yeah. Three courses, it's great. I think the overarching strategy for good up was to kind of, as Sandra was saying exactly, is to bring a newer and more vibrant and youthful energy mm. to the Cape Tonian and the Cape radio yeah. landscape. Because I think that there's so much creativity and there's so much talent. And good up FM has, as the longest running, still existing breakfast show in yeah. the country, always championed up and coming talent that is about to be discovered and make it big. Wow. So in Good Up FM, you've always heard the most creatively powerful radio, you've always heard the most boundary pushing and edgy and interesting content, and you've always been encountering people starting out and then establishing their careers as epically good and talented people who will then be remembered forever. And that's the vibe that we're bringing back with oh. this new lineup. Yeah. Yeah. But you know, it is a massive responsibility taking people to work, driving them to work, helping them start their day. What is your unique approach to The Breakfast Show? I can't drive. Uh, <laughs> So I spend a lot of my time empathizing with people who can and trying to get them to know. So I think that what is really important to understand about uh, morning radio is that you need to juggle a few things. Yeah. The first thing that you have to do is tell people about the world because then when they wake up, they definitely don't want to get a shock of getting to work and not hearing that something massive happened in whatever field or another. Mm. Yeah. It's our responsibility to give them that news that we find important and to give them a light-hearted and feel-good spe mm. uh, spiel and feel yeah. on that news. And then the other thing I think that's really important is with all of your favorite pieces of content is if somebody can give you something truly unique and wonderful okay. to talk about, remember, and download yeah. later. Like when we imagined that Harry Potter 9 was based in Cape Town. We talked about the philosopher's abalone. Wow. We talked about the <laughs> deathly Poloni. Sure. A couple of days ago, we rewrote That's Havana vintage, by Camila yeah. Cabello to oh, wow. be about Havana Unana. Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> You're not getting involved. No, I'm not getting involved. <laughs> so we give iconic, yeah. unique content that people will remember because they've never heard anything like it before. That's the joy and the magic and the power of entertainment and especially radio. That's that's what only our show does in this yeah. city, oh, and I would say amazing. this country. So exciting. We can't wait to catch up with Good Up FM a little bit more. They're not going anywhere no because way. today radio and TV are it's a beautiful marriage between these two. Yeah. Dalen and Sandra, of course, are stalwarts at the whole <laughs> breakfast vibe. Uh, Jerry, we want to hear a bit more of because you're doing this for the first time, hey? Yeah. These early mornings. Yeah. Oh, and she looks absolutely fabulous. But so much more to come. Good Up FM is in the house.